this draw and you will take it from here. Thank you, Thank Mr. You. Sand. Thank you. Thank you very much, Mr. Sand, for this explanation and speech. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, now we start the draw allocation ceremony. This ceremony is consisted of four steps. So right now, we'll start the first step, and in this step, I will be assisted by my colleague, Leila. With great pleasure, Nazim. So we have to define our five big uh, countries of big five, and plus Azerbaijan, of course, uh, tonight we have only five envelopes. So Nazim, please. Thank you. Yeah. Okay, now you can, it's your turn, you can take and show us the name of the country. Name of the country that will vote. Italy. And now Leila picks one of these envelopes. I will pick that one, please. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, Italy will vote in semi-final one. one. What about the second country? Of course, the second country from this range is United Kingdom. Please. Here you are. Ladies and gentlemen, United Kingdom will what? In semi-final two. United Kingdom for the second semi-final. The third country that will vote in the final is Azerbaijan. <laughs> Azerbaijan will it's vote now. Um, please. Let us see, ladies and gentlemen, in which semi final will vote the land of fire? Semi final one. In the first semi final. The next country is France. It's your turn to take the envelope now. With big pleasure, Nazim, please. Thank you. The France will vote in semi-final two. And the last country is Spain. Ladies and gentlemen, last country, Spain. Spain will vote in semi-final one. So five countries, we decided, we defined which country will vote in which semi-final. So we can go on? Yeah, the absolutely. Next step. Thank you very much. Please, Mr. Sand. I'd just like to add one thing. Uh, Germany has been granted. Uh, to vote in semi-final two uh, after a special request. So they will vote in semi-final two, Germany. And now you see all the, um, the countries on the scoreboard, and then we can continue. Yes, Mr. Sand is absolutely right. Germany will vote in semi-final two. Thank you, Mr. Sand, again. And we are going on with the next step. And our next step, Nazim, is? Is to define, we'll have, ladies and gentlemen, two balls and these two balls will help us to define how many countries will be in semi-final one and how many countries will be in semi-final two. But in this case, I will ask my assistant, Sabina, who will help us to define the countries. So we have to call our all assistants, Nazim, to bring us all the countries here. Thank you, beautiful ladies. So we have six boils and countries in each of it, but now we have to define how many countries we have in the first semi-final and how many countries we will hear and see in the second semi-final. Yes, Leila. So let's start. We will start with envelopes. Ladies and gentlemen, attention. Please, Leila. Yes, of course. Sabina. We will define in which semi-final 19 countries will compete?
In the second semi-final. Second semi-final. We will hear 19 countries. countries. Please. Ladies and gentlemen, 18 countries will be in semi-final one. So? The time is right now for the next step in draw allocation ceremony. We will begin with the first semi-final. Let's start with first semi-final. And the first six countries for this range. So, Montenegro for Montenegro the first semi-final. Montenegro will be... in the first half of the first semi-final. Next country is... The next country is... Iceland. Iceland will be... in the first half of the first semi-final. Please, Leila, right now, next country, give us yes. its name. Next country for the first semi-final is... Moldova. Moldova will be in the second half of the first semi-final. Ladies and gentlemen, the name of next country in the first semi-final is Cyprus. Cyprus will compete In the second half of the first semi-final. Fifth country from this range is... Romania. Romania will be... In the first half of the first semi-final. And the last country out of this range. Austria. Austria will compete in the second half of the first semi-final. Ladies and gentlemen, now I will ask my colleague Leila to start another round of draw allocation ceremony. Yes, our next round is for the second semi-final and the first six countries for this range. Serbia. Serbia will be in the first half of the second semi-final. The name of next country? Sweden. Sweden will be in the second half of the second semi final. We have third country. And third country is Georgia. Georgia will be in the second half of the second semi-final. Thank you. What about next country? It's okay about next country. It's the Netherlands. The Netherlands will be In the first half of the second semi-final. The name of next country, ladies and gentlemen. Portugal. Portugal will compete 
in the first half of the second semi-final. Leila? Yes? The last country out of this range. Yes, the last country for the second semi-final for this range is... Slovenia. Slovenia will be... in the second half of the second semi-final. Thank you, colleagues. We start another round of this ceremony. We back again for the first semi-final and the next six countries for this range. Okay, it's Albania. Albania will be in the first half of the first semi-final. The name of next country, ladies and gentlemen. Denmark. Denmark will compete in the second half of the first semi final. Next country for the first semi final is Russia. Russia will compete. in the second half of the first semi-final. And the next country... Belgium. Belgium will be... in the first half of the first semi-final. The name of next country. Latvia. Latvia will compete of the first semi final. Thank you, colleagues. And the last country out of this range. San Marino. San Marino will be in the second half of the first semi-final. Thank you. We have some countries left still. Yes, of course, we have to watch which six countries we have else in the second semi-final. Absolutely. Former Yugoslavian Republic Macedonia. Former Yugoslav Republic of Macedonia will be in the first half of the second semi final. Next country is Estonia. Estonia will be in the second half of the second semi-final. The name of next country. Belarus. Belarus will compete in the first half of the second semi-final. We have next country. Turkey. Turkey Turkia. will be in the second half of the second semi final. The name of next country, ladies and gentlemen. Malta. Malta will be. in the first half of the second semi-final.
the name of the last country in this range. Slovakia. Slovakia will compete in the second half of the second semi-final. And time is up right now for the next step. Yes, the next step is about the first semi-final again. Right. Switzerland. Switzerland will be in the first half of the first semi-final. The name of the next country in the first semi-final is Finland. Finland will compete in the first half of the first semi-final. The name of the next country Israel. Israel will be in the second half of the first semi-final. The name of the next country. Greece. Greece will compete in the first half of the first semi-final. Leila, the name of the next country. Yes, of course. It's Ireland. Ireland will be in the second half of the first semi-final. The name of last country out of this range. Last country for the first semi-final is Hungary. Hungary will compete in the second half of the first semi-final. Ladies and gentlemen, we'll proceed with the next step of our draw allocation ceremony is for Eurovision Song Contest. We defined all the countries for the first semi-final, so we can go on with the second one. Croatia. Croatia will be in the second half of the second semi-final. Next country. Next country is Norway. Norway will be in the second half of the second semi final. The name of the next country. Ukraine. Ukraine will compete in the first half of the second semi final. Ladies and gentlemen, next country is Armenia. Armenia will be. In the first half of the second semi-final. Next country is... Lithuania. Lithuania will compete... In the second half of the second semi-final.
And next country. Yes, one of the last, last countries, by the way, is Bulgaria. Bulgaria will be in the first half of the second semi final. Thank you, Leila. We have the last country left. Yes. Let's check up our memory and think what country we didn't call yet. Can you do it? I'm not. D don't you remember? I don't remember at all. Maybe our guests remember? Russia. No. Russia we, has we gone already. Russia. We've got her. Bosnia. Bosnia and Herzegovina, the last country for the second semi final. Right. Bosnia and Herzegovina will be. In the second half of the second semi final. Thank you. Thank Ladies you and gentlemen, so much. right now you're kindly requested to look at the graphics on your left and right sides, and you will watch right now the results of draw allocation ceremony. You know, Nazim, during the uh, draw allocation ceremony, I could define which countries, delegations from which countries take par taking part here by their applause. But I would offer to make one big, mighty applause for all the countries in this year's song contest. We'll applaud all the countries that will compete in this year's Eurovision Song Contest 2012. Nazim, East is East and West is West, and they will never meet. Who said it? World known Rudyard Kipling. It seems I could not even imagine that such a spectacular event as Eurovision, time will come and it will take place. Established in 1956 and covering initially only Europe, today Eurovision Song Contest have, hasn't got any geographical frontier. By hosting Eurovision Song Contest, Azerbaijan, located within Europe and Asia, will prove that the contest gets wider and wider in scope. Ladies and gentlemen, throughout, throughout the, world, the world history, yes. <laughs> Azerbaijan was the pioneer in many fields. The first Azerbaijani democratic republic, the first opera and ballet in the Muslim East. But before entering the world of pop music, we want to invite all of you to the amazing world of Azerbaijani music. And now we will take in by the swirling wind to the famous Azerbaijani Mugam performed by world-known singer Alim Gasimov. To the places we will be amazed by subtle music, samples of Azerbaijan, in the presenting of our talented vocalist Samir Jaferov and Aygün Zeynalova. That will be followed by our short promenade in the streets of the ancient old city, accompanied by the sounds of Azerbaijani jazz, performed by the Montreux Jazz Competition prize winner, Iswar Sarovsky.